Hello, Fight fans. I'm Todd Grisham. Welcome inside the Grand Theater. Alongside me is Johnny Nelson. About time to. Time for our tale of the tape. Eddie Hall, the world's strongest man fighting out of Leeds. 300 pounds. No one in the heavyweight division is as terrifying as this man. If you're going to give away so much weight, you've got to depend on speed because if you miss, it hurts from a bigger fighter. Eddie Hall, the beast. You don't need me to tell you that he's a heavyweight. In fact, the world's strongest man fighting out of Newcastle, United Kingdom. From the United States of America. It'll be ding ding from Perth, Bob. They're off. And with that, let's go into the ring and the Hall of Fame announcer himself, Jimmy Lennon Jr. This bout is scheduled for 12 rounds of boxing. Fighting out of the red corner from Newcastle under Lyme, England, the first man to deadlift 500 kilos, the 2017 World's Strongest Man, Eddie the Beast Hall. Fighting out of the blue corner from the United States of America, wearing the black trunks trimmed with black, we welcome you to this beautiful theater. Shakespeare has nothing on the drama that we've seen between these two fighters. Todd, I'm gonna stay here till the end of the night because if you're a fight fan like me, this is what I live for. So they stare into each other's eyes one final time, touch gloves and get prepared for battle. We're hoping for an all action slugfest. Nice slip to avoid the jab. That counter punch up, and the referee will begin the count. Ten seconds to get up. I don't see any movement here. It looks like this one's going to be over. And as we see it again in slow motion, there's no doubt. That body punch right there buckled him. Shot from the gods, they say. A shot from the gods. One, two, three, four. So the referee says he can continue, but how much more does he have left? Todd, he's up. Uh, I'd be surprised if he makes it back to the corner. And if he does, will he get back up from the stool again? That was a shot. A perfect counter shot. They won't stop firing power shots. Let's see if it works out. He's got the advantage halfway through the round. Just missing with the uppercut. Perfect game plan. The thing is, can anybody figure out what to do to change this? It's a perfect start. The audience absolutely right on top of you in this very special environment here. You've done everything tonight. And you know what? When you're in a theater, you know you've got to perform. There's no coin corners. There's no making up excuses because you're going to be so transparent and laid out there. That punch scores. How about that time counter shot? Ten seconds to go, and what domination we've seen in this round. A huge momentum swing that's going to be considering that round will be 10 8 after the knockdown. I love the response though. Got back up, took a deep breath, and thought, right, brush it off, get on with the job.
And that'll do it for the time between rounds as we get set to get back in the action. They ring the bell and here we go. He got knocked down in the last round. Let's see what he can do here. What a heavy knockdown. How are they going to come back from that? They staggered back to the corner. They've got to freshen them up, alert them again, get them back on point again. This round, they've got to coast around. Don't get involved. Give yourself another three minutes and get your head clear. The perfect counter lands. changes everything, especially in this division. This fighter doesn't just want to win by knockout. They want to do it early so they can get out of here. How you deal with a slugger? You've got to use brain over bone. Bull in a matador. Pop, jab, move. Get them angry. Nice exchanges from both men in this round. You'd like to see someone use a jab here to establish a boxing presence, but no, they just want to fight. Perfectly matched. Skill for skill. Tap for tap. Now this fight will say, you know what, I'm just that notch above you, and so I've got to respect both of them more than happy. That punch scores. What's the referee thinking right now? Changes everything, and down they go. I think that will look even more dramatic in slow motion. I've got to see that again. that knockdown's gonna be we just saw. You've been put down, you've got to think right, survive and then give it back the next round. Time winding down as we get set to jump back in the action. And there's the bell to start the round. He couldn't finish him off in the last round. Let's see what this has in store for us. What a knockdown. One minute, you need one hour to get over a shot like that. Now it's down to conditioning. Now it's down to mental strength and preparation. It's how you are going to deal with it. So once again, they'll clinch, and one of these fighters has got to take the lead here. You can't do that too often because the referee is eventually going to start taking points off you. You saw the referee watch, look, then... Stumbling around on Bambi legs! Has he weathered the storm? Now they've got to wake up, they've got to get on the back foot, clear the head a little bit, then jump back into it again. It's all about the hustle. Yep. The, and Eddie Hall goes down! They knew it when they threw it. The perfect body shot, and no one's standing up to that one. Even I've got to see that again. Where did that come from?
You heard that right, ladies and gentlemen. A knockout victory and one of the biggest surprises of the year. Accuracy, power, punch perfect. That must hurt.